You may know them mostly for the new Whirly Bandra ceiling or for the integrated township Lavasa that's coming up near Pune. But HCC is an integrated infrastructure player which now wants to monetize its high-profile road portfolio. Will PE investors bite, though? Dave Navora finds out. After the ceiling in Mumbai, Ajit Gulabchan's HCC is turning its attention towards roads and NDTV Profit learns as its roads portfolio gains size, HCC is exploring the possibility of putting all the different projects into one single roads company, hive that off and then rope in a private equity player as a strategic financial investor in it to infuse cash. Company sources say HCC has appointed Ernst & Young to advise them on how to monetize the portfolio and preliminary talks have already taken place with four private equity funds, Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley Private Equity, Bain Capital and Carlyle for a 10 to 30 percent equity dilution in the proposed roads company. HCC is undertaking BOT or build, operate and transfer projects and even designing and constructing roads. The roads portfolio now forms 22 percent of the order book and is growing. The management feels the financial viability of these could take EBITDA margins as high as 30 percent. A couple of uh, assets which are commissioned, uh, couple of assets which are under execution and uh, a couple more which are uh, which are in L1 situation so about six to seven assets uh, is what is the portfolio right now on the roads in the BOT area uh, park circus and many other such projects are in the design and build which is a standard cash contract uh, business that we do in the roads area it's clear that the road vertical is gaining scale. HCC has already pumped in 100 crore rupees in just three BOT projects, but plans to infuse 400 crore rupees more over the next few years. But a private equity partner also brings in additional financial muscle. On camera, however, the management did not want to give out too much details. There would always be uh, strategic uh, partners and uh, one would always evaluate them based on uh, you know, the requirements at that specific point of time. Uh, that's what gets done, but uh, uh, I, I wouldn't say that there's a strategic shift or something. Private equity players find the sector attractive depending on the toll potential. So far, private equity investors have taken exposures in individual projects, but getting a chance to invest in a portfolio company de-risks them as well. And considering HCC can boast of bagging the high-profile highway contracts, be it in the national capital region or in Maharashtra and Andhra, this is one infra deal that one expects to wrap up sooner than later. In Mumbai with Dev Navora, Archana Shukla, NDTV Prof.